Good morning. It's uh, coming up on uh, 1 o'clock in the morning on this now uh, early Thursday. Went to the Blazer game today, came home, looked at all the latest forecast models. So uh, here's the update, and I'll, I'll do some, another update, of course, during the day on Thursday. But, you know, we're going to start off cold in the morning. Uh, it looks like uh, most of the area will be around 20 degrees. Some areas could be in, uh, you know, 17, 18 degree range, very chilly weather. I still think we'll start to get increasing cloudiness Thursday afternoon. Now, this, this uh, disturbance coming down Thursday overnight, Friday morning is actually starting to look more wet again, similar to what it looked like back on Monday. And there are forecast models now that show the following, uh, that show that there will be some snow maybe into Washington County uh, Thursday overnight into Friday morning. Maybe Forest Grove, Hillsborough could get some snow. And then south toward McMinnville, Salem, maybe as far north as, say, Canby. So it's very possible that... Uh, we do get some spots that get at least a coverage of snow. It could be a dusting to an inch, um, you know, maybe two inches the farther south you go down towards Salem. So this still bears watching. And we're talking about a fine line. So could this track change a little bit and bring a better chance of snow cover up into Portland? Uh, absolutely. Yeah, interesting, by the way, that one of the better spots to get snow will probably be the Oregon coast. Real good chance that there will be a couple inches of snow in some of those areas. Again, this possibility of snow accumulation sets up after midnight Thursday and then ends by late morning Friday. So this still bears watching, uh, especially if you live south of Portland. Saturday, really cold, low temperatures, uh, a better chance of seeing outlying areas in the mid-teens, maybe even as cold as 12 degrees Sunday morning. All right, I'll talk to you soon.